hi there it's your girl yeti day here again so a couple of days back i posted i made a post um asking how much you think it's okay to start up the fashion business and i got lots of comments like you need fifty thousand naira you need zero naira you need one million naira you need you know different responses okay i even had someone that said um you don't need any any bulk money to start up your fashion business okay so i thought i should drop my um what i think about uh, my own answer to the question i posted okay so yes um in as much as we all need money in business but um let me just share my story and you know i like to talk about my story okay so i never had any bulk money to start up the fashion business the way it started if you know my story so well um i started back then in school while i was still in school making skirts and um, selling to people so um back then all i needed was i think a yard of um the material i used the fabric i used poly cotton was just about 500 naira so i know that if i buy um two yards that's ten thousand um sorry what am i saying that's one thousand naira and i would get two skirts out, out of that so that was how i started so i never had any bulk money if i have ten thousand naira what i know i did then was to invest more in fabric so any money i have i just go up and buy fabrics so that was how i started and then i started making a skirt for myself and then i started selling to people when they liked it so it turned to a business after a while because people liked what i always add on so i never had any book money and of course that way there is no how i wouldn't have money so i had to just roll up the money over and over and over again but what i can remember i did um i did intentionally was um during my service year i made sure i did not touch my um my allowance from access bank i saved the access bank then so what i did was um saved i saved up the money and i would always buy industrial machine back then so then it was about fifty thousand naira so um i knew that after i saved i was able to buy some machines and all so if you ask me now so that was how i started i never had any book money i never had any grants or anything that you know i never had that i just buy things if i know i need a table i call the carpenter how much is this i buy the table if i know i need an iron i buy the iron so i didn't have any book money to start and that is to tell you that you can start with the little you have you can start with as low as 500 naira, um sorry five thousand naira you can start with ten thousand naira it's just what you do with them and how you market your products that matters now yes yeah, so that was how i started then but looking at it now um you know for people that do not have a business plan and what do i mean by business plan is you already know what you want you already know the the store you want to have you know you, you want to set it up as a proper business immediately yeah that's when i will tell you yes you need bulk money but if you are the one that um started like me you're just there making skirts or making clothes out of passion um you work from your house you know you can always start small you can always use your i can remember back then i used to cut on the floor like the towels by the time i get up my feet my knees are hurting me you know and then um i had the regular black machine so you might just want to invest in the machine first yeah that's fifty thousand euro. that's if you do not have a business plan or any plans to um any funds to really start up even immediately so you can just buy the necessary things your machine so all you have to do is you have to know the cost of the machine buy that table i'm sure if you look around you i'm sure you have one or two things you can cut on you know and then that's it with your machine you're good to go all right and then instagram is there whatsapp is there they are not collecting rent space from you all you need is your data you know so that's that but if you have a proper business plan and what do i mean by that you already know um the location you want to set up you already know the kind of fashion house you want you already have a mood board showing you everything you want for your fashion house what you want your fashion house to look like now you have to start writing out the cost what does it cost me to buy um sewing machine or oh, i want to start with five sewing machines you write out the cost I want to have so so staff i want to have a pattern drafter how much do they charge i want to have three tailors how much do tailors charge although that one comes later but the basic things like okay your tables your mirror your industrial um iron your your you know basic tools you need you know your fashion space the chairs you know all those things can come up in your business plan and that is when you say yes you need actually bulk money to run the business except also you want to start up a ready to wear line you know you can always say okay how many collections am i starting with how much do i need to invest how many of these clothes do i want to have 
on my rack you know how many do i want to sell so once you do those i mean the costs and all that then you can arrive at a bulk money but really for fashion it's different strokes for different folks really it depends on how you want your fashion business it depends on how you see yourself you might want to have a store in the mall of course you need a business plan for that you know before you get your racks and all that but if you're just starting small um if you want to start a fashion business and you do not have bulk capital you can always start small with what you have okay so yeah that's that about what i wanted to share with you so there is no fixed amount to what you need all you really need is your sewing machine and this and to work on back then i knew how to cut and sew so what i used to do then was just cut the clothes and then i add joiners who joins for me but in the case where you are just starting out you already know that's why i always say that you should try to learn the technical side of the business as well so if you already know it you can actually work so many things out by yourself depending when you already have a market and then you know when to expand really you know when to expand and then you already have um bulk money but if you want to go into it like full time this is what you want to do and you want funds to just kick off the right way or you just want to set up immediately you want to get a store and all that then you need a business plan put everything in place everything you want I have a mood board that shows you everything you need your fan your acs everything you need come up with a cost and then that's how you get to know how much you need for your fashion business i hope i've been able to clear this aha so um don't hesitate to drop your comments in the comment section okay and i'll be there to respond to you remember our all um all our courses we have the fashion and design course where we teach you how to cut and sew we also run different business courses entrepreneurship how to start a clothing line um bookkeeping for your fashion business how to structure your fashion business we have about um six major courses on fashion entrepreneurship um yes yeah, so don't hesitate to make inquiries and then we'll be more than happy to respond to them okay take care bye